Welcome to this video supplement on module 11, Community Profiling. So when we do a community profile, what we do is actually uh, is to make an attempt to describe a particular community, area, municipality that we are working it, or even maybe a specific group or sector in the community where we are. A good community profile should build or give us a picture of the community and we can use various techniques to do this and we can also make use of various perspectives and the results or findings from a community profile can be used to institute a particular action so let me illustrate this by providing two examples of uh, community profiles that I got from the internet so uh, this first example is uh, from a project that was uh, co-sponsored by the Department of Education as well as SMART through its SMART Schools program. Okay, so they worked with this school in uh, Mindanao in the province of Davao Oriental and as part of this project the uh, various stakeholders uh, came together to produce this community profile. So, uh, as you see, this is a very simple community profile wherein first they've provided a simple map of uh, the municipality of Lupon in Davao Oriental. So, there is a short description of the municipality, uh, it being first class, its history, versus the first settlers, how the municipal district was created, how it eventually became a regular municipality as well as some information about the cultural background of the area and interestingly enough a listing of all the mayors of this municipality so it's a fairly short but concise uh, community profile and I guess even if it's this short it uh, was able to meet the needs of the project partners who are involved in this project so this is a community profile that was produced as part of a uh, project so contrast this with another type of community profile this one is uh, from the uh, website of the municipality of monologue for teach in bukidnon so this one is more of a community profile that was drawn up by the municipality itself as part of let's say promoting and providing information to the general public about uh, this municipality so uh, they put here the profile in terms of the land area okay and then they have this interesting and useful table of the different barangays in the area and then the land classification and then the climate topography and slope of the area, soil, population, the overall population of the municipality, as well as the various barangays and also the growth rates in these uh, barangays. They've also included in their community profile income classifications, the priority programs of the local government. So this is very interesting. Uh, materials they've also have some tables providing some pictures about uh, specific medical and dental outreach services they've also mentioned the different areas of uh, priority projects that we we're working in so this is another example of a community profile and I'm sure that in many of your municipalities you have done community profiling in your area